So what happened is that during winter time, the Daphne stops giving live birth, and now she start making eggs that they will lay down for the winter time, and the eggs will fall into the gravel, and they'll stay in there. As the water dries up, the eggs stays in the gravel or sand, and by next year, if you added rainwater, any type of fresh rainwater, it stimulate the eggs to hatch. And you can see that the Daphnia are hatching from this tank. Now this tank has gravel and sand from the other tank that I drained and I put the rest of the gravel and sand in here about a week ago. And you can see after I added rainwater, Daphnia starts hatching in here. So that's very nice. And um, in a couple of weeks, when the weather is a little bit warmer, more sunshine, we should have a whole bunch of them. You can see them all, a dozen or so, just swimming around here. Not much right now, but I've got the bubble going here. And what I'm gonna do is we're gonna give them some green water because it's been cloudy lately, so. We'll feed them green water here to get them going. So during winter time, they drop the eggs. And the eggs sometimes can float, sink, and this is a bucket. And right there, you can see the eggs right there. See those eggs? They're like two little dots. Let me zoom in here for you guys. Right there, those are the eggs right there. You can see them right there. Got one, two, three, four, five, six of them right there. There's a whole bunch of them around here, but get a close shot for you guys here. Right there. So those are definitely eggs. And what happened is that once once they know that they get good water, the eggs will actually hatch. And I got a whole bunch of them around here. See them on the corner here? There's a whole bunch of them around here. So this was actually from another tank and it cracked. So I put all the gravel and water in here and hopefully they will they will hatch. Cause this is just rainwater. You can see all the eggs around the edges here. Here too. There's, there's a lot of them here. So I'm thinking more like a week and this will be filled with Daphnia. So, so that is what the eggs look like. You can see it there. They're right there too. Two dots. So those are good eggs right there. All, they're all over here. A whole bunch of them here. So this are what the egg looks like. Give you guys a close shot of what the eggs are. So here they are. Just like that. Right on the tip of my finger. They're very very small eggs. Right there. Pretty small. Two dots. So each female will hold about uh two dots of eggs. I think this they can hold up to like so many, but I don't quite remember. But they'll drop this. They'll drop the eggs every so often. They're about that, so we put them in the tank here. They'll hatch off. This is good water, so they'll hatch. They'll hatch. But there's a whole bunch of them in there, so might put some in here. I think these are the Russian red and plus a few other ones. So I'm not too sure what are in here anymore. That's a mix of three species or something. I haven't even forgot about it.